Hello and welcome to CJC Adventures. On a blustery day we're in Bilston in the city of Wolverhampton. Very small town Bilston. Hope you're going to enjoy it. Let's look at some of the history of this very small but charming town. Well, there is one or two pubs round here, are there? Yeah. Elk and Ivy. All the reeds are for here, don't they? Like Poppy Day. If you go over here, all the names felt in the wall. There's quite a few. It's got the uh, lead dogs who follow each other, but their names and sacrifices are not forgotten. This war memorial was dedicated during the centre of the First World War in memory of that was about the ultimate sacrifices. Good to see tributes like that though. All the names not being forgotten, putting putting stone as they say. And you've got the police station just right here. Right on the edge. Uh, everlasting tribute. We will remember them. Well, this is one of the older buildings, mostly old buildings in Bilston. Sir Henry Newbolt, 1862 to 1938. He was a poet. He was born near this place. Saying it. A lot of bus services through here, do you? Old relic of the past. Hotel. Rock Tower. Proper old steel buildings, are they? Oh, yeah, no. That's what it is, eh? With a... I'll make them like that anyway. Yeah. It's a free library. It's always a free library, eh? They never charge it, eh? Yeah, you've enjoyed the free library. Part of the council, eh? Well, there's a bundle of what you pay at the council. That's a good one, eh? Mm. It's part of the... Stop people. It's all scanned up. Oh. To have an author, eh, to... well, this is a town centre, the nice. Yes, yeah. this is a town hall. Mm -hmm. Partly new, partly old. Look at that wind chime up there. Oh. Oh, there's some way up there, eh? There. Oh, yeah. Proper old chapel out like these. <laughs> Tell by the wind is cool, yeah. yeah. Well, you look. You look. You look along here, you know, it's. Uh, Proper relic of the past, eh? Oh, we're on there some years, are you?
Chicago Art Week chains. <laughs> now, Bilston is a market town, and a man named John Wilkinson built his first blast furnace in 1748. A long time ago. And for those of you who have ever bought weighing scales, whether it be to weigh yourself, weigh fruit, uh, well, weigh just about anything with cooking, you know that Richard Salter, he began making his first spring scales in Britain, in Bilston, in the late 1760s. Bert Williams, he was a goalkeeper for Wolverhampton Wanderers nearby, he also played for England in the 40s and 50s. Also, David Dacre was born in Bilston in 1935. He's a British actor. He was in Z Cars, Porridge. He played Harry Crawford in Boone. He made guest appearances in Heartbeat, Only Falls and Horses. He was also from Bilston. Great actor. Many about on a Sunday anyway, he's a real man. Eh? Hello pigeon. That's what you get in town centres. Now this is the town centre, but long gone is the Theatre Royal. And Bruce Forsyth back in 1942. Aged just 14 years old, made his first stage performance. But of course, that's since gone. Also, James Fleet, who was an actor, born in 1962, who was in Four Weddings and a Funeral, and the Vicar of Dibley. He was also from Bilston, along with Don Powell, the drummer of Slade, and Slade also played their first ever gig here. Pigeons took tea out, Craig. Oh, After his dinner, eh? <coughs> Ground and punch bowl. That is actually structurally unsafe, but it's a pub that goes back many, many decades, many decades, but might not be there much longer. As you can see, it's just tilting to the one side. Never been in, but apparently a nice old fashioned pub. Oh, Craig just treated us to a McDonald's. Very nice indeed, Mark. I'll let mine and Craig's out in his in there, so. Yeah, yeah, the plane. Yeah. One left. That'll be greedy, Craig. Try not to be. I'll let no mine, Mark. On a rainy day. There's just me and Craig. Who'd have thought it? A rainy day in Bilston. 
and then it's just me and Cree walking about doing sightseeing things. Well, the murals on the buildings, do you look? Oh. Another Robin too. This originally used to be called the Robin too, but it's called the Robin now, and it used to be Muriel this had. And uh, yeah. uh, we we'll say Roy Wood on this day. Uh, that's why the there's an hotel to it as well now. Do you remember that time we said Stephen Seagal here? Oh, all that good at singing, but it was just nice to see him, were not you? Ah, he's signing autographs for a film star coming to Bilst. Uh, we've done it. Mm, we, we've had a drink in here before. Oh. They say you got the old police station across the road, look. It's the police yeah. station. Yeah. Cop shop. Yeah. That's the inside. See Roy Wood on the wall there. They say you wouldn't tell me it's Roy Wood. Yeah, Carol Decker. Oh, I was asking, no, I didn't say, the 80s channel I was talking. Yeah. I was talking. Uh, well, that's where he stood, Craig, Stephen Seagal, when he visited the Midlands. Just, just imagine, if you lived over there, you yeah. could have seen him. Oh, it's Stephen Seagal over there, look. Well, that's where he stood to sign his autograph. That's the back part to it. Blow monkeys. Blow monkeys I still like that band I did. The vicious ferrets. So that's Bilston's main entertainment venue. Good memories. Some bad but mostly good. Watching CJC adventures. It's been nice to come around this time. If you like this video, please give it a like, please subscribe. For those of you who have watched, liked, and subscribed, thank you very much, it really means a lot. Until next time on CJC Adventures, bye bye. I'm Phil. Okay, got us lost. <laughs>